Hello, and welcome to a Thursday edition of Robert vs. the New York Times Crossword. Today we're going to do the Thursday, March 30th, 2023 Crosswords. Going for that 1126 day streak, so here is your spoiler alert for the Thursday Mini. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Mini is always free to play. Alright, let's do it. Uh, MLB. Some Moose. Linus. Boz. Uh, usual. Testy on the fly, but no, no, bones. Bleat. Bleat is better than Boz, <laughs> which I, there's not enough letters for. MLB, because it's opening day. Shout out to all the baseball fans out there. Ribs are indeed bones. Should we look? Yeah. We've got a moose bleeding in this one. Very nice. Anyway. Now for the main event, that's the Thursday Daily Grid, which is by Adam Wagner and Brooke Husick today. Here is your spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The Daily Grid does require a New York Times game subscription. Thursday is my favorite day of the week, hardest themed puzzle of the week. So let's see what Adam and Brooke have in store for us. Let's get into it. It's true, maybe a fact, made out, like a mind that can solve crosswords, maybe agile, chops evenly, maybe cubes. What arrows might might point at. Less deeply appreciated and not my favorite. Probably meh. And we to Abu, Abu Dhabi direction. It must just be east. This is O. House of Strasse Hut. Rooney Mara. Soft opening? Question mark. Microsoft maybe. Once again. Drat slash drat. Activist known as the mother of the mother of the freedom movement. Like spaces reserved for compact cars. That's narrow. I wonder if this is Rosa Parks. This is the crease. Brillo offering. Some kind of pad. This is Ode. Agua. Tease slash tease. Okay. Around with intelligent. Maybe it's elegant. Okay. Oh, maybe it's rib roast. Oh yeah, I see. Both of those can mean to tease. Um, so what was this again? Drat slash drat. Crap. Hmm. Wasteland. This is fared. Just a desert. But maybe it's meant a lot. Lax LAX option. Nora Lum AK Aquafina. Size of reliever just Oz. Is there NCOs? Soap pad? I repeat. Pronoun pair, she, her, I guess. Many, many stringed instruments, a harp. Tech support service. Rays, maybe? And tricep curls, right? Arm hair, funny. This could be bisect. Okay, let's go back up here. Those are ores. These are targets. Dairy owl purchase, maybe it's eggs. Two-stringed Chinese instrument. Pre-sale alert. Faith that follows the teaching of the Bob. It's Baha'i. One might be turned down in bed. Toilet slash toilet. Something head. Space where people pay to destroy household objects with sledgehammers. Come back as a retort. We. It's itty or itsy. This is okay's, I think. Crap shoot, I see. Uh... What is this? TSA pre, like pre-check? Interesting. Pothead tries to swat bats at or something. Down pat and pat down, like a sheet of dollar bills. Uncut. This is Etsy. This is the average. Spoiled. Look, I colored on the walls how model trains are built to scale, maybe. Faints on the ice are deeks. This is El Cid. Bill and Ted's excellent adventure. Foolable. Naive. This is Evie. E ticket. Quit quit. Blank joke. Uh, zodiac sign transition. No idea. Ruined though. Cusp. Ready to roll. Sale for a retailer. Got busy on and hits up privately. DMs, rage rooms. I see this is dropkick. Trim, 
dad joke. Aim. Huh? Oh, I see. You, they aim to sell. Herd, herd. Nice. Raise, maybe. Hmm. This is the yips. Purity ring question mark. All right. Baby Roo. Maybe it's bats at. Nice. Super? Super something? Blast. This is got caught? Uh. You what? I see a bet like in poker. In gear, like in your car. So wheat, I see. Hmm. Uh, PC help. Halo. Set to. Go at. Go and once. No. Uh. Uh, so, so what's wrong here? Uh, Pre-sale alert. Probably gonna feel dumb when I figure out what's happening here, but I don't see it yet. This all looks okay, maybe... Mm. Okay, maybe I run the alphabet in this square just to see, and I'll probably... I don't think it's gonna work though. No. Oh, going once. Hits at. Okay. Alright, it's better. Just a new... no, Erehu. If made bats at seem reasonable. Okay, going once, going twice, sold. All right, so we've got themers here that are clued by the same word twice for each half. So ri both rib and roast can mean tease. Both crap and shoot can mean drat. Both got and caught can mean herd. Both pot and head can mean toilet. Both drop and kick can mean quit. I think that's very interesting. I think it was sort of a pleasure to uncover these. If you think something is a pleasure, I guess it means it was a pleasure, right? <laughs> yeah. Got caught is sort of the, to me, the weakest one. The other things are like very much like singular entities somehow. Yeah, very interesting. I wonder I'd be interested to know what other options they had. Uh, I would say that the fill was actually kind of hard today. Lots of stuff that I sort of wasn't sure about. So let's switch over to this, take a look through this thing. I, I like the theme. Uh, and I guess, you know, it's hard-ish because the meaning of the final word isn't really there, include anywhere. It's just each half and you have to think what phrase could there be where each half can be clued with T's. Not not easy to come up with rib roast from that, but... And then I think the surrounding fill maybe made it kind of hard. From here, Microsoft. I like, I like this echo. Mar contents and mare contents. Just water in Spanish and water in French. Crease in hockey, which I'm familiar with. Soap pad. Is that a is that a thing? Steel wool soap pads. An SOS soap pad. Steel wool saturated with soap. I don't know. To me, this reads as a wordless word rather than like a word that people actually use. But you know, people from all over the place use different words, so. I also don't think people say TSA pre. I really don't. I think people say pre-check. 
I'm gonna acknowledge that when I Google this, it's gonna Google fairly well, probably. Ah, I see pre-check like that. She doesn't even Google that well. Yeah, I don't know. I guess that's kind of interesting, but any time it's pre, it has this check afterward. It's like a registered trademark or whatever. Yeah, pre-check, sure. But do we, I don't think people say TSA pre. That's why I like kind of questioned that when I saw that. It's at, yeah. This is where my big issue was because I never heard of an airhoo before and airboo seems reasonable-ish. It's a two-stringed instrument. I mean, I, I've like maybe seen in movies people playing this instrument, but... I think I'm more familiar with the... The guzheng, that's an instrument, right? <laughs> yeah, these, which have many strings, but... By more familiar with, I mean, I'm just trying to say that I know, I know the name of that instrument, but not this one. I guess that's all I'm saying. It's not particularly compelling. And gah. We've got this cross-reference, which I think is a reasonable cross-reference. Yeah. You what to scale in gear? A trio of two-word answers. PC help also. Lots of concerts in this one. Yeah, so I think that that somewhat made this general southwest section difficult. These uh these two word fills I find are just harder. And then this air who. Yeah. Not super easy for me. I meant a lot by that. commissioned officers there. I like the clue a lot on arm hair. Tricep cut curls. Can you ever clue arm and hair as the same word twice? I bet I would bet that Adam and Brooke tried. Uh, so I'm not gonna try. <laughs> yeah, I never know if it's itsy or itty or Never heard of rage rooms either. I guess these are like, you know, one of these modern trends where you can throw axes and stuff. A smash room or an anger room. Hmm. I wonder what it says about... <laughs> First rage rooms were likely in Japan in 2008 or earlier. I wonder what it says about, uh, about us that we have these rage rooms. So... It's an interesting question, maybe. We've got pat and put. We've also got EVs, electric vehicles, and EV clued with EV. So, uh, interesting. So wheat. Yeah, that's that also made this section difficult because it's so informal. Yeah. I guess we've got this two stringed instrument and this many stringed instrument. That's kind of a callback clue, also. Yeah, overall, I'd say this is a. Uh, I found the fill kind of hard, but it is Thursday. It's the hardest theme themed day, so sort of should be hard. So nice puzzle, nice nice theme. Really makes me wonder how many more of these you could possibly do, and this is a, this is a nice collection of them. Very nice. Of course, Adam and Brooke are both very well known, very well regarded constructors working together. Make a nice puzzle. Just under six minutes. Seems about right for a for a Thursday. Uh, what I thought was a somewhat tough Thursday. Anyway, let's now do the plus word. Here's your spoiler alert for the plus word. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here. Click on the link in the description below. Plus word is free to play. It's by the Telegraph. It's uh, like British mini crossword meets Wordle. I say it every day, but if you're a new viewer, why don't you give it a try? There's a link. Let's do it. This is Dumbo. Re records or records up to the time of his until like a good Christmas. This is Bruce Wayne and this is an otter, I believe. This was inert. 
Prance is to strut. Sorceress. Don't know. This is Slyer, though. This is Mary. Cersei, I think. Okay. And so we have Couch. We do have Couch. Yeah, Dumbo here is sort of a giveaway. Cersei, I've heard of. I'm pronouncing it right. Probably not. I've Googled Cersei on this channel before. In Greek, Kirky. Because <laughs> with Kappas, but... Yeah, mythology is a big weakness of mine in my trivia knowledge. I tried to study before Jeopardy. Didn't really make that much progress. It's really hard to learn something that you don't know. But uh, yeah, sub 30 second plus word. I will take it. Last thing we do before we go here is take a look at the mini leaderboard for tomorrow where we've got stickers in 123. Shout out to you, stickers. Hope you're doing all right. I haven't seen stickers in a couple weeks now, so I should probably go try to hang out with them. No one on the secret leaderboard. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I'll see you tomorrow for some Friday puzzles. See you then.